Yeah, so here is the um, station to the Zvital, the Zvital. And, um, yeah, I mean, as you can see, it's basically like something from the 1930s. Still got the factory here. And, um, yeah, not even the trains have, have changed, really. <laughs> yeah, I really find that interesting. And, yeah, and for me now, um, I'm going to a... Uh, I'm going to a wine town, um, uh, Olimuts, not so touristy. I'm really looking forward to it. I'm just hopping on a train. I thought I'd share this with you before I go. Yeah, so here's a bit more of the town. So here we are um, in the park Yana Palaka in Zvitavi or Zvital, uh, as I've said, the uh, birthplace where Oscar Schindler was born and grew up. And uh, right here we have his uh, monument. Um, so here we are, the man that saved 1,200 Jews who otherwise would have been sent to the death camps. Uh, it used to be a 90% German city, whereas now it's where they're all expelled and ethnically cleansed. But as you've seen from the other video, the city centre has been really beautifully um, uh, preserved. And um, whereas the modern stuff, uh, unfortunately, has, um, you know, sp spoiled it, but luckily it hasn't found its way into the city centre. Um, so the, yeah, the Austro-Hungarian um, remnants of architecture still remain. I'd, it was a really enjoyable time, there was a really cool festival as you saw earlier and yeah I'd recommend it uh, for anyone who wishes to visit. I yeah, hope you're doing great, hope you've had a great day. Um, over and out. Yeah, so we're in uh, Zvitavi, um, hometown of Oscar Schindler. So where I'm standing now um, is in the church of St. Marie, I can't pronounce it in Czech sadly, it's too complicated. Um, this is where um, obviously Schindler was a Catholic and this is where he would have uh, worshipped um, uh, growing up and where obviously he would have been with his family and his wife. Um, so I'll just show you around quickly. Um, it's pretty nice in here. Yeah, so there you go. I thought I'd add that to the video. Um, I hope it was worthwhile and uh, have a great day.